friend. Ah! The mage has turned your friend into a demon. Yes. You said it was a spirit of wisdom, not a fighter. A spirit becomes a demon when denied its original purpose. So they summoned it for something so opposed to its own nature that it was corrupted. Fighting. Let us ask them. A mage! You're not with the bandits? Do you have any lyrium potions? Most of us are exhausted. We've been fighting that demon. You summoned that demon! Except it was a spirit of wisdom at the time. You made it kill! You twisted it against its purpose! I, I, I understand how it might be confusing to someone who has not studied demons, but after you help us, I can... We are not here to help you! Word of advice? I'd hold off on explaining how demons work to my friend here. Listen to me! I was one of the foremost experts in the Kirkwall Sir. Shut up. You summoned it to protect you from the bandits. I... Yes. You bound it to obedience, then commanded it to kill. That is when it turned. The summoning circle. We break it, we break the binding. No orders to kill, no conflict with its nature, no demon. What? The binding is the only thing keeping the demon from killing us. Whatever it was before, it is a monster now. Inquisitor, please! I've studied rituals like this. I should be able to disrupt the binding quickly. Thank you. We must hurry! I'm sorry, Sonus. Don't be. We gave it a moment's peace before the end. That's more than it might have had. All that remains now is them. Thank you. We would not have risked the summoning, but the roads are too dangerous to travel unprotected. You tortured and killed my friend. We didn't know it was just the spirit. The, the book said it could help us. Solus. Never again. I need some time alone. I will meet you back at Skyhold. Inquisitor. How are you, Solus? It hurts. It always does. But I will survive. Thank you for coming back. You were a true friend. You did everything you could to help. I could hardly abandon you now. Where did you go? I found a quiet spot and went to sleep. I visited the place in the Fade where my friend used to be. It's empty. But there are stirrings of energy in the void. Someday something new may grow there. 
What happens when a spirit dies? It isn't the same for mortals. The energy of spirits returns to the Fade. If the idea giving the spirit form is strong, or if the memory has shaped other spirits, it may someday rise again. You're saying your friend might come back? No, not really. A spirit's natural state is peaceful semi-existence. It is rare to be able to reflect reality. Something similar may reform one day, but it might have a different personality. It would likely not remember me. It would not be the friend I knew. I'll let you get back to work. All right. Thank you again. 